concerned. I mean, how's it been for you in terms of just uh, getting acclimated, not only just to this team, but also just getting acclimated to having younger guys like Cam around as well, seeing guys like Amir too? You know, it's, uh, it's been fun so far, you know, um, just you know, helping the young guys learn, you know, Amir's a sophomore this year, you know, Cam just came in, you know, a few months ago. So, like, you know, just helping the guys learn, it's, it's, it's been fun, fun, you know, seeing everybody's improvement, you know, it's only, it's only day six, but, you know, it's, it's a lot of improvement. You know, from day one already. What improvement would you say you made from the off season? Well, from last season till now. I just feel like you know I did uh, Latin off I mean uh, off season, you know, uh, close ground, you know, uh, you know, advised me to do a lot of hamstring, you know, and groin work. You know, I feel like you know it helped me be a lot more explosive player, and you know, I feel a lot more explosive out there. So that was one of the things you know I see improvement in, you know, so far in spring. When we talked to you at Habitat for Humanity, you said you were kind of looking forward to you know, getting role, getting more reps uh, with Dalvin. Uh -huh. Not being here, I guess. What what has that been like? Uh, How's this new role been for you? You know, I just take it day by day. You know, um, you know, go out there and work every day. You know, because it, it's just you know, it's a blessing to be in the, in the position. You know, um, and then playing with the guys. You know, the position group we're in right now. You know, our group is so talented. You know, so every day we come in, everybody pushing each other. Because you know, we got you know, RG. You know, from Vickers. You know, Cam. You know, Amir. It's just it's so fun to come out here and just compete every day. Because we, we all get each other better, and we all doing you know, our work. Do you feel a need to kind of compete with those guys, or are you kind of trying to take a leadership role among everybody there? You know, I say I want to kind of be like the big brother, you know, uh, in the group, because you know uh, I got I got experience here. You know, I've been learning in my third year, and uh, I just want to you know help them, you know, um, bring them along. You know, what I'm saying I'm helping them any way possible. You know, what I'm saying in this group, I feel like this group is close. You know, so like you know, and there's no you no know, one guy trying you know be selfish. You know, if someone needs help, so like, we all we all help each other. You you came in as a you know big. Five-star recruit like Cam has also. Uh -huh. Are there things that you can teach him in terms of handling just the transition to college? Yeah, like you know, um, Cam, I, Cam played quarterback in high school, so you know it was kind of similar to what I did. I played quarterback, so now I had to transition to you know come in here and play running back, you know, full time. So you know, it, it's it's pretty cool, you know, because we got a lot of things we can relate to coming out of high school. But um, it's been it's been pretty cool. What are the issues with that going from quarterback? To Oh, just like small things, you know, just taking handoffs consistently, you know, sometimes, you know, you shuffle them, like, you know, I had a, I had a problem with that, uh, you know, because, you know, I was playing quarterback, you know, so you, you just got to keep, you know, um, in the, the uh, flow and the rhythm, you know, with the quarterbacks. So that's, that's just one of the small things, you know, but it, 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 it's, it gets over real quick. Have you seen Cam kind of adapt to what's going to be expected of him here? I mean, Cam's been doing well. He's been improving each and every day, and that's the uh, best thing about it. You know, you can you just see the improvements each and every day, and that's and I'm happy for him. You know, um, yeah, yeah, yeah. the guy is gonna be really good. I take it. I take it. I How do you feel like you've gotten better from this time last year to now? I just feel like you know, I feel like I'm more supposed to play. You know, just you know, put a lot of time in the weight room, you know, in the film room, you know, just asking for advice, you know, and just knowing and knowing everything, you know, not second guessing anything. It's just it's just you know, when you know everything, you can go full speed, you know, and that time, you know, and that, that right there. Um, push you ahead of people. Does it feel different knowing now? I mean, you know, last year you guys had Dalvin, and while you were able to play, it was you know, a lot of times sort of in a supportive role. But now that he's not here, do you feel like it's going to be more responsibilities for you? I just, you know, I'm just taking it, like I said, day by day. You know, uh, you know, whatever uh, role coach give me, I'm going to uh, embrace it. You know, I feel like uh, I'm ready for whatever role he give me. You know what I'm saying? I, 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 I've been there before. You know, I started games. You know, so uh, I'm, I'm excited for, you know, the opportunities. You guys, you and Dalvin got to do the two back stuff some, and uh, Jimbo talked about maybe that's something you guys can do in the future. How much do you like that? That's uh, when you two tailbacks at the same time. Oh, that's a fun, you know, because you know we when we want to see we want, like, we all want to see each other do good. So you know when it used to be me and Dalvin going out there in the two back, you know sometimes you know Dalvin's such a sports runner, you know he'll go out there and block for me. You know what I'm saying? So it's like it, it gets you like you know excited, you know, give you like you know a rush because you know a guy like that, you know, what I'm saying he's gonna be a first round pick coming to the draft. You know he was out there blocking for me. You feel me? So I, I just like it, it was a it was a great feeling though. So we trying to do the same thing out here, you know. I, I know these guys look up to me, so you know what I'm saying. I'm, I'm you know what I'm saying. I'm out here. I'm doing it for the group. You said uh, you're getting some advice. Who are some people that kind of advising you or you're you know picking their brains to kind of help you? And I just I always talk to um, Dalvin. You know, you know he's you know what I'm saying he's done. He's already done it. You know he's going going to the next level. And I always talk to Coach Graham, you know, and you know, the guys that have been around the program, not just necessarily my position, but guys that's already done it, you know what I'm saying, that can give me insight, you know, how to do it, you know, and do it the right way. You mentioned the idea of becoming, becoming more of an explosive player. What do you have to do to sort of make that happen? Is it like conditioning type stuff, weight training? Yeah, a lot of weight training, a lot of conditioning. You know, the fourth quarter program really helped that, you know. Uh, and that's probably one of the toughest things, you know, you'll do at, at this program. But it's just, you know, the, the weight room was the uh, biggest thing for me. I just got it in there. You know, um, uh, Coach Brown gave me some things to work on, and I hit it hard. You've known 
with DeAndre for a long time. Um, have you kind of seen, I don't even to want to say like a change, but him getting that full year of starting experience, has that done anything to make his mindset different, any more vocal, anything like that? Like, <laughs> man, yeah, yeah, man, he, he just, it's, it's crazy because like, you know, just from last year to this time to, you know, this year, you know, he's just so, like, so cool, like, calm, collected out there, you know what I'm saying? Everybody, you know, just gravitate off him, you know what I'm saying? He's our leader, you know, and everybody, you know, look to him, you know. And he, he, you know, guys, you guys can see he's a great quarterback, you know what I'm saying? It's fun playing with him. And I played with him before, so, like, you know, I, I always knew him as this cool, calm, collected guy, you know. But, you know what I'm saying? It's good. It's like, it's, it's fun, you know, to see it transition to college, you know. It's, it's pretty cool. A neat thing. Kind of have a, this is our time kind of thing. Like, it's t our time to kind of show. No, nah, we. I mean, we always had dreams and stuff. You know what I'm saying? We lived together, so we always, you know, talk about our goals and stuff. So you know, we, we have those kind of talks. And how does it kind of help your kind of take on this role that you are to start? Oh, he just, you know, he just, you know, he always been with me from day one. You know what I'm saying? He always, you know, he always give me advice, you know, or feedback, you know, what I need to, you know, improve on. You know what I'm saying? It's vice versa too. You know, if I see something he's doing, you know, I can, I you know, he, we have that type of relationship. I can, you know. Like, yo, bro, you know, you can do this. And then, you know, it's, it's vice versa with me. Oh, you, you can do this, bro. So it's like, it's a, it's a fun relationship, you know what I'm saying? It's more like a brother, you know, than a friend.